No threat of rain whatsoever. Luis Soho and his group from Spain come into this game one and two. Italy two and one. And it's a hard ground ball into left field. Up with it is Maggi, his throw to the plate. Oh, it's a slide and he's safe. Bo Maggi couldn't squeeze the one hop throw. One nothing Spain. Naguera is 0-1. Is hit in the air, fairly deep to left. This one's got the height. Does it have the distance? No, it does not. What a great run and grab made by Lester Galvan, who puts his team ahead with a single in the bottom of the first and then makes the catch that ends the inning and keeps the game 1-0 after one and a half. We'll be back in 90 seconds here on a beautiful Saturday night in Parma. drawn in on the grass, and Rodriguez rolls it under the dive of Masanti. And there's the second run for Spain, a 2-0 lead. Smart baseball. Beltre popped out to short in the first inning, and now he lines one out to right field, and with one out, that'll probably bring in another run. Here's the throw towards the plate, cut off, and it's 3-0 Spain. A walk and a single. All that Spain has. Chris Colabello leading off the fourth. Swings at the first pitch, sends it high and deep into the night sky in Parma and puts Italy on the board. That was a blast. And it's 3 1. You don't mess around with Chris Colabello, not the way he's hitting at this Europe Africa Olympic qualifier. His second home run of the tournament, his eighth RBI. And the spark his team so desperately needed to start this fourth inning. I didn't see it come down. I'm not sure it did yet. Giuseppe Mazzanti. Takes a moment before settling in himself. That was a thing of beauty. And it really makes you think back to the seventh inning last night and shake your head at what a shame it was to have him forced out of the game when he was hit in the face. And then a bounce back tonight. Infield in. Outfield shifted slightly the other way. And a fly ball out towards right field. This will be a test. Is it deep enough? Monson makes the catch. Here comes Cicchini, the throw, the tag, and he's safe. That I was unaware of until four years ago at the Premier 12 in Taiwan to really take a, about a five-minute break, sometimes even a little bit more, and a nice running grab made by Reginato, crossing into foul ground for the second out of the bottom of the fifth. But they take that five-minute break, and while the ground screw's doing their work, cheerleaders come out to amuse the crowd. Same thing gets done in Korea and Japan. And it's here in Italy, too, for the Europe-Africa Olympic qualifier. It's not quite a halftime. Baseball just doesn't have Deals with the cleanup man, Jesus Ustari. Spain already leading 3-2, to two, threatening to add a little bit more. And they may do just that. This one's headed towards the wall, and it will score Oscar Angulo. The very first pitch he sees. Goes all the way down the line and left into the corner. Maggi rips it into left field. That's a base hit, and it could bring in a run. Here comes the throw towards the plate. It's cut off, and it's 4-3. Italy's got the tying run in scoring position with just one out in the top of the seventh. It's looking like maybe 12 o'clock noon. Here's Chris Colabella with the game on the line. He swings at the first pitch, sends a two-hopper to short. It's bobbled, but there's time for Rodriguez to go to first and end the ball game. 